What's going on guys, your boy Mr. Crazy1870 and today we're going to be taking a look at the Switch Easy Rebel Touch for the Apple iPod Touch 4G. Now this one here does come in about four different colors. You can pick it up in a purple, red, white and black. This will set you back at about $27.99 plus $3 shipping and handling. You can go ahead and pick this up on Switch Easy's website and as always I will have their link in the video description. Make sure to go ahead and check that out. Now, as far as the packaging goes, you get the same style packaging as the Switch Easy Capsule Rebel for the iPhone 4. As soon as you open up the package, you are greeted with the Switch Easy Rebel Touch. And Switch Easy also includes everything but the kitchen sink, as always. They include two screen protectors, two universal dock adapters, a video stand, two headphone jack protectors, two connector protectors, and a microfiber cleaning cloth. So now let's go ahead and take a closer look at the Rebel Touch. Now this is a two-piece case. The first one would be the inner layer, which is sort of like a silicone slash TPU material. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. Now the inside, it is very soft, so it is definitely not going to get the back of your iPod Touch scratched. And then you have your outer shell, which is poorly carbonate. Now as far as installing the Rebel Touch on my iPod Touch, I really didn't experience a hard time when it comes to installing the case. What you're going to want to do first is go ahead and grab your inner layer first, place your iPod Touch in it, start with your volume buttons first. Once you have that side done, go ahead and jump onto the next side and you just snap in place. And now you're going to want to go ahead and grab your outer shell, go ahead and line it up with your volume rockers. Once you have it lined up, go ahead and jump onto the other side and you snap in place. Once you have that side snapped in place, go ahead and jump to the top. And this center piece here, go ahead and snap that last piece in place and you should be good to go. So now that the Rebel Touch is installed on my iPod Touch, I'm going to go ahead and give you a quick overview of the iPod Touch with the case already installed. We're going to go ahead and start here at the bottom. You get a single cutout for your headphone jack, 30 pin dock connector and your speaker. Now I did try this out with both my chargers, my third party iPhone 4 charger and my original iPhone 4 charger and they both worked well. We're going to go ahead and take a look at here at the side. Your volume rockers are covered and you also get a very good amount of tactile feeling. Now looking at the top, your sleep and wait button is covered also and you also get a very good amount of tactile feeling. Now looking at the laying the table design, you get a pretty good amount of lip going all around the screen of the iPod Touch. One thing to note here at the bottom by the home button, it is a little on the flimsy side, really nothing too annoying. Now looking at the back of the iPod Touch, here you have your cutout for your camera and your mic. You get your nice spine in the center. You also get Switch Easy's logo here on the back. So I also want to go ahead and show you how your iPod Touch is going to look with your connector protectors already installed. So here I have both protectors installed. I have my headphone jack protector and my 30 pin dock connector protector. Now they also include a cutout for your speaker. Now these are in there pretty secure. I don't think you're going to be having a hard time with them coming out loose or even losing them when they're installed on your iPod Touch. So now we're going to be taking a look at the video stand that was included in the box. Now you could go ahead and use it with your iPod Touch standing up and it is on there pretty secure. And you could also use it with your iPod Touch being on landscape mode. And it also makes it pretty cool to watch either YouTube videos or Netflix on your desk. So my final thoughts on the Rebel Touch for the iPod Touch 4G. Now this is a very comfortable case. This is going to be one of my favorite cases for the iPod Touch 4G. Now you get a pretty good amount of tactile feeling when it comes to accessing your volume buttons. You get a good amount of lay on the table design. It also feels very comfortable when you're navigating to the home screen of your iPod Touch. You also get a very good amount of grip. So I know that most of you guys were waiting for the Rebel Touch for the iPod Touch 4G and it is finally here and it also was well worth the wait. So I think that if you were to pick yourself up a Rebel Touch, I don't think that you'll be disappointed one bit. So that was a quick look at the Switch Easy Rebel Touch for the iPod Touch 4G. Now before I end this video, I just want to go ahead and apologize to you guys. I know that my voice still sounds kind of funny, but I just wanted to go ahead and put this video out there for you guys. I know some of you guys were asking me if I was going to go ahead and review the Switch Easy Rebel Touch. 
So hopefully you guys enjoyed my review. And if you have any questions in regards to the case, please feel free to leave them down in the comment section down below. And I will try to do my best to go ahead and get at you guys as soon as possible. So that is about it. Your boy, Mr. Crazy1870, signing out. And please do not forget to check out my two latest videos at the end of this video. You guys have yourself a good one. Late.